Even after they swept through their exhibition schedule undefeated, the experts weren't giving the Houston Oilers much chance as a contender for Eastern AFL honor. But after two weeks of championship play, they are still undefeated with victories over the Jets and the Patriots. Now they trot into Oakland's Frank Ewell Stadium to test the Raiders. Al Davis's Bay Area men are one and one and itching to knock the Oilers out of the undefeated column. Bones Taylor gives veteran George Blander the starting assignment and Blander responds by lofting the ball into the arms of Ode Burrell. Burrell has a couple of steps on his man and he pulls away for a 48-yard touchdown. The Oilers take a 7-0 first quarter lead. The slow motion camera records a beautiful pass play as the Raiders strike back. Tom Flores aims for Art Pal at the sideline and Art hooks around his defender for another couple of yards. Flores drops back from his own 31 as Clem Daniels works into the clear. Daniels takes the ball over his shoulder and he'll be tough to catch. It's a 69-yard touchdown as Oakland ties it up at 7-7 in the first period. The Raiders are deep in their own territory after a Houston punt, but Clem Daniel gets them out by bursting through the line and racing away to a 49-yard game. Oakland is on its way. The Raiders get sidetracked right here. Tom Flores passes to Clem Daniels. Clem has the ball, but Johnny Baker knocks it loose and recovers to take over for the Oilers and kill the threat. Flores tries to get the Raiders going again in the second quarter. He evades the rush and fires, but throws too high for Art Pal to hang on. W.K. Hicks intercepts and races 26 yards to the Oakland nine. On third down, Charlie Tolar bangs into the middle, but he can only make it to the three, and Blanda elects to go for three points. It's an easy 10-yard boot for the 37-year-old star, and the Oilers move out to a 10-7 lead at the half. Oakland opens the third period by driving from its own 23. Alan Miller works his way for a first down on the 38. Now Flores hands to Clem Daniels, who cuts back beautifully and powers for 11 yards to move into Houston territory. Alan Miller makes a beautiful fake into the line, and Flores has all the time in the world to hoist a perfect pass to Art Pal, who high steps into the end zone for a 43-yard touchdown. The Raiders take the lead at 14-10. Houston's undefeated record is in danger as Don Kroll tries to move the Oilers midway in the final period. He hits Charlie Frazier for 10 yards. Kroll has Houston on the move. Watch this perfect pass to Willie Frazier. It's 17 yards and a first down on the Oakland 11. Kroll dances back from the floor and looks for one of the Frasers. Willie's all by himself and Troll's pass is pure perfection as Houston regains the lead. It's 17-14 with about four minutes left. The Oilers regain possession with a minute and a half left. All Troll has to do is hold on to the ball, but he can, and Oakland recovers on the Oilers' 17. Opportunity knocks, and Tom Flores answers with a pass to Art Powell. Art has it just inbounds at the five-yard line. With 58 seconds left, Flores doesn't try to run it in. He sends Alan Miller into the end zone and hits him for the winning touchdown. The Raiders pull a thriller out of the fire by dumping previously undefeated Houston 21-17 with less than a minute left to play. Oakland serves notice on the rest of the AFL that the Raiders are ready to move into a contending role in the Western Division.